I was in I was in a very low place and I needed some help. And I realized all in all the money in the world wasn't going to put me back together again. The pain was internal. Um, shortly thereafter, my mom started coming to the hospital and saying, Hashem, you need to read this book. And I didn't want to do it. And the book was the Bible. And as I began to read the Bible and I became, I ran across all of these phenomenal stories. And I said, well, God help those people. Maybe God could help me. And then I came across the gospels and I learned about Christ. And I learned about this, um, you know, when someone harms you, you have to turn the other cheek. And, you know, the disciples asked him, well, what should you do when someone, you know, hurts you? And he said, you should forgive. And the disciples must have been like you and I. And they said, well, how many times should we forgive Christ? And he said, well, 70 times seven. And as a 15 year old, I was doing the math. I was like, that's just a lot of forgiveness. <laughs> and um, I realized that I felt like Christ and God was speaking to me, Hashem, you have to forgive, you know? And, um, Maybe I wouldn't get a miracle to walk, but the real miracle was the depression that people couldn't see, you know? And uh, I read about forgiveness and I said, you know what, I'm gonna forgive my mom and dad for separating and abandoning me. They didn't care about me and I, was, I had a grudge against them. I had to forgive my mother's boyfriend. I realized, well, you know, he has his own issues and I had to forgive the kid who shot me. But then the hard part was forgiving myself because I could blame my mother and father till a, the end of time, and I could blame the kid who shot me, but at some point, I had to take ownership on, Hashem, you made those bad decisions. And that was the hard part. <laughs>